class went great. At least I feel it did anyways. And also I have laundry out the wazoo. Fun! This garbage is leaking so freaking bad. Oh. Oh. Well, that was gross. Anyways, I have to go to Michael's to get some things for my observational drawing class. I need to get some ink and a, a pen, because we're starting pen and ink next class. And so, I have to go get that stuff. Oh my god. Oh my god. There used to be like a guinea pig one here. I think they bought all the guinea pigs. Hmm. Ooh, but there's a beaver. There's a beaver. It's not right. It's not right. Found my pen and ink. I'm good to go. Solar system. Fresh robot. A robot that goes along on a brush. It's powered by rapid vibrations from a shorter brush robot that will sweep you away. Soda can robug. Rocks. Well, that went pretty well. I got my pens and my ink. And I actually got some fabric paint too for plushies. Speaking of which, um, if I didn't show it in yesterday's vlog, and I'm pretty sure I didn't, when I get back to the apartment, I'll show you guys the plush I'm working on. And I'll also open discussion on something plush related when I get back to the apartment. But first, I gotta find some food, because I'm, I'm kind of hungry. I'm at Wendy's. I've actually only been to this Wendy's, which is in the general area of the pyramids. I've only ever been to this movie once, and that was back when I was rooming with Sarah, Brianna, and Morgan, and I didn't even have my car at this time. Wendy smells good. I'm probably thinking of getting myself a new billfold sometime in the next month or so, because this one I've had since, like, middle school, probably even earlier than that, probably elementary school. And this part right here, where the little thing is attached, it's like, oh my god, so thin from age, and being carried like this on my um, key clip whenever I like have to go pick somebody up and I don't have my purse. Well, I, I do have my purse, but I don't want to take it because I'm lazy. And so, yeah. Probably gonna get a new billfold. Definitely going to the mall tomorrow to get new socks. And. And headed for the sky! Say, come sail away! Come sail away! Come sail away with me! Come sail away! Hey, Howie. Mm hmm. Tell the world what happened. Oh, hi! <laughs> oh, your your band aid, your band aid. <laughs> so, I was like, what? So, tell the world what happened. I had an interview at Subway today, and I got the job. <laughs> <laughs> so I now work at Subway, making five dollar foot longs. Actually, they're six dollar rip offs. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, here's... I got, Let's not let the subway people hear this, okay? I mean, 
I love my job and foot longs are great. Even when they're six dollars. <laughs> Was that a good? Actually, the sign the sign does specifically say that um, unless it's five dollar foot long season, that um, the most of the foot longs are like six bucks. Yeah. And so it's not it's it's not like they're ripping off. <laughs> Uh, some of them on and the menu are actually four dollars, and then when you make it a meal, it's six dollars. Yeah. And they're bringing back the new meatball thingy. Meatball pepperonis. Yeah. Yum. It's March special. You should go check it out. I'll say that everyone. if you work at Subway, you could like suggest good sandwiches, <coughs> like like a Philly cheese kind of thing. But there was a Philly cheese. There is a Philly cheese. <laughs> Philly like, cheese is gross. Without the cheese, though, like something that's like more salty onions, maybe some like sauce, like. Okay, that that thing I was telling you about in the car. Da na na na. It's an incomplete tune link. Speaking of plushies, that made me think of something. Um, I'm currently working on a script for a plush crazies. That's the plush puppet shows that I do on my main channel. And, um, the script is going to be an adaptation of Alice in Wonderland called Don't Eat the Mushroom. And before you ask, I did not get that from the original source. I got, I got the Don't Eat the Mushroom title from watching The Runaway Guys and Chugga and Proton John being like, Hey, don't eat the mushroom. I eat your face. Anyways. Um, I'm probably going to put up a list of the cast either right here or in the description box. And they're all they're all plushies that I've made, so... Yeah. And I was wondering if you guys have any ideas for, like, any jokes that won't really affect the plot for these characters to make, to make it, like, more original than the original, I don't know what I'm trying to say, to make it more, um, standing out than the original Alice in Wonderland, like, make it more separate, then go for it. Just, just shoot me a suggestion. But don't literally shoot me, because that would, that would be bad. How would you even get to me to shoot me anyways? That would be, that would be frightening. You know, somewhere in related note, I have three badges in platinum as of today. Hey, okay. aren't they beautiful? <laughs>